does that even mean, Bowers Game Corner? Ahoy there, YouTube! I'm back again today for another gameplay video. And today I'm here with my lovely wife, Melina. Hello. And we're going to be playing Ragnarok. So this is the follow-up to Santorini uh, from Gordon Hamilton. This is from Gray Fox Games. It's for two players. It's going to take us about 15 to 30 minutes to play. And we're actually going to be playing two games of it. We're going to start off with the basic version, but then we're going to play a game with the advanced mythology cards. But it's still a relatively simple game. Now, we have it set up right here. Uh, the blue player is going to be over here, and they are going to have three. And the red are going to have three over here. Now, what you're trying to do is on your turn, you are going to do two things most of the time, dear. You are going to move in one direction as many spaces as you would want. So if you were right here, you could go in any of the six directions around yourself as many spaces as you want. So right now I could go there, one space, or I could go all the way over there, or I could go all the way over here, any direction around you, as long as you don't run into someone else. If you run into someone else, or if you run into a rune stone, then you do have to stop, all right? So the first thing you're going to do is you're going to move. Then the next thing you're going to do is summon what is called a rune stone. So once again, we'll go with back to this example right here. Let's say you move to this spot somehow. You can put the rune stone anywhere around you in any of the six directions as far as you want to go as long as you don't go through a viking or a rune stone. So let's say that this rune stone was right here. That means I could put a rune stone here or here or here or here or here or any of those spots, any of these spots. And either of these two spots, but I would have to stop right there if I wanted to. Now, the goal of doing this is to eventually enclose yourself inside of an area. Because once you're inside of an area, you, so let's say you just went right in here and then you pop that right there. You're going to score a point for every single one of these. That Your Viking has settled into there. You won't be able to move this Viking anymore, but you're going to get a boatload of points. And that is the crux of the game. Now, if you somehow sneak into here, which is a totally solid strategy, I would imagine, neither of us gets the points. So you've essentially negated my huge chunk of points right there. We continue to go until uh, neither player is able, is able to take a game turn, and then we'll have a winner of the game. We'll tally up the score. Ready to rock and roll? Sure. All right. The blue player will go first. Would you rather be red or blue? I'll be red. All right. So... Throw you some over and over some rune stones. And by the way, this is a prototype I have in front of me, but as you can see, it looks uh, it looks pretty dang good. So That's a prototype? It's, it's 3D printed. Really nice, huh? What? Ooh, yeah, I know. All right. We're going to go right there, and then I'm going to send this. Uh, color me impressed. Uh, I don't know what I'm doing, so I'm going to, ha-ha, I'm going to send it right there. You're not supposed to knock my guys off. Okay, that is, no, I'm not. I don't think that, I haven't read the rules, but I don't think that's in the rules. <laughs> It's one of the mythology powers. Leave me alone. What are you going to do? Block me? I don't know what I'm doing. <laughs> I've never played the game before. I don't even know before. what's going on. All right. You're, you're trying to I settle just your move Viking and I lands. I put a rune stone and try to get as big of an area as I can. Yep. Is that you right? You move first, and then you summon a rune stone. I move. You set up to six. Uh, but No, you can move as many spaces as you want. You can move as far as you would like. Or... As long as it's in the line. Yes, it's one of the six directions. Yes. Six directions. That's where I got six from. Yeah, because if you're here, you have six directions. But, like, this guy only has four directions he could go. That, oh, see? Now then I can't go like that. Got it. That okay, would be cheating. I got it. And I have read the rules. All right, going right there. I don't know what's going on. I don't know. I don't either. All right. Going right there. All right. Why not? So I'm going to select. Find out what happens. Uh, I'll go right here. And I'm going to go right there. You. I don't know if that's a good move, but I like it. These are really cool rune stones. Yeah, like I'm impressed with these. Well, they're prototypes. Yay, 3D printers. That's amazing. Alright. Um. It's in my way. The camera. She's referring to the camera. Yes. Not there. I can't be next to you? No, you can't. Just don't do it. Oh. <laughs> gotcha. I gotcha. Ooh, okay. 
That seems like a solid move. I don't. Uh, this is this is I really interesting. Is. All right, I'm gonna go right <laughs> here, and I'm actually gonna go ahead and place that right there. Huh. And now look at look at red pinned up in that corner. But is that a bad thing? I don't know. It is yet to be seen. But I can put the thing anywhere I want, right? In any of the six directions, yeah. As far as you want. I mean, you can place that right there if you really wanted to. Okay. I like how the board is filling up. I think it looks neat. This is... This, this, is, this is interesting. Okay. All right, look over there. Okay, let's see. Because then you're like, what's a good move? What's not a good move? Don't know. Um, I don't have a clue. I'm going to go ahead and... Where is this guy? Is it the black? I'm going to go ahead and... I'm going to slide him right on over here. And then we're going to go right there. <laughs> is the idea to close yourself in yes you want to score the points so if you jump over here i now have to try and figure out how to get you the hell out or get me out or i think it really adds to the the, the battle sheep's formula it reminds me of battle sheep but it, it definitely feels like step in up way, which i yeah. like it. um holy moly No reds allowed. Too bad. Oh, oh, huh. Interesting. I don't, I don't know what to do. Um, hmm. We're going to go ahead and go right here and here. <laughs> this is neat. <laughs> Body block. Well, luckily, when we play the next game, one of us will be the pig, which is going to let you shove someone because, uh, and we'll get into this, but there's mythology cards and they just, you pretty much just pick two at the beginning and they each have your own special ability. Um, ma'am, can you what? get the hell out? Oh, I thought I did a wrong move. You okay. did. You did the moves. Hey, you, you, you jerk. You jerky. <laughs> this is supposed to be my half of the board. You and? get the other half. And? Um, I don't know what to do now. Do I block you in? Do I just eat that bullet? I mean... Okay, we'll go ahead and I don't know if that's a good move, but it feels like not a bad move. <laughs> because it's not area control. Even if you have two here, I'm pretty sure you don't overpower me or anything like that. We just don't get the points. You don't get the points unless you're yep. in by yourself. Settled regions are the only one that score regions, and that a region containing Vikings belonging only to a single player. So, yep. Not area control here. It's something different. Well, I guess it is still area control, but it's a different... It's, it's a literal area control as opposed to the figurative area control. No, that doesn't make sense. Hmm. Are you done? Yeah, you still take your turn. In fact, I was just I know, stalling I'm for just... time because you you got a little bit more AP than I do. No, I'm just looking at you, trying to, like, watching your face. Like, it's... Well, no, this is me start, trying to stall for time. Okay. Yeah. Trying to make some interesting banter go on while you decide on your move. Interesting banter. Yeah, I normally have to do it with the kids a lot, so it's just <laughs> a habit. <laughs> okay. Okay. Get in there. That is such an interesting move. Because I feel like I can 
to lock you in. Uh oh. Uh oh. It's your turn. Now, my problem is really okay. Huh. Wait, no. No, I'm staying right here. Go there. That's fine. Right. Can I jump over you? You may not. Yeah, yeah. Hmm. I think you need to. There we go. I think I might have you on this one. Yeah, yeah, I'm not very good at these games. Well, we also didn't really know the ebb and flow to expect of this one. You yeah! Nice move. Very nice <laughs> move. Um, hmm. What do I do? I don't even know. Oh, uh, I got. I got to move this guy, right? He's got to go there, and then just. I don't even know. Um. Just be king of your own little area over there. Uh, I guess I'll go here. I don't know. I don't know. Okay. I'm not getting in there. So I score those points. Yeah, but I'm not getting in there, so. All right. That's interesting. Uh, I'm going to go right here. Yeah, I screwed myself over, didn't I? I don't know. It was going to be I'm really. I'm not getting points. Well, all. you would have to. Yeah, you're, you're going to check. I'm not getting points at all. You're not right now. It's going to be very hard. No, it's not going to happen. Yes, Just I know. period. I know. Don't say right now. It's not going to happen. No, no, no. It could happen. If you block this guy off, you'll score some points. You're not going to win. I mean, this is, this is, but let's wrap, wrap the game up at least. But yeah, you can still score points if you can block off the blue guy. I just don't think you can score. Yeah. So I guess at this point, my best interest would be to go. Yeah. See, it's not going to happen because you're, you're able to move. Yes. So I would score these points right here. And the only one that scores points. So I won. But I'm trying to show people, play, try and play the game, dear. Okay. Remember? 3, 7, 9, 11, 12, 14, 16, 17, 18. So I would score 18 points and no other points would be scored. This would just be an uninhabited area. And that's the whole game. So, wipe to the side. And now I've selected just the top two. But we're now going to pick one of these cards. So I'll just let you pick first, and this is going to give you a special ability. So I'll explain what they do, and I just randomly picked two, but I think this is... One. Okay. Uh, you want to be mean, or you want to be weird? Do you really think I want to be mean? Yes. I'll let you be mean, so that way I don't have to be mean. I think that's a good idea. Would you agree? I don't like being mean. Are well, it's, I don't even know if it's mean. It's just you're going to shove me, which sounds mean. <laughs> Uh, so my guy, on the end of my turn, I can summon rune stones in any number of spaces adjacent to your Vikings. In any number of spaces adjacent to your nomadic Vikings. Interesting. 
All right. What does yours do, dear? Um, I can push. Okay, it says if you're selected. If your selected Viking's path is blocked by another Viking, you may push the obstructing Viking back one hex into an unoccupied hex and continue into the vacated hex. So yeah, you shove me out of the way. Unoccupied is capitalized. All right. I don't know why. Maybe it's a buzzword? Maybe. All right, and I went first last time, so you can go first this time. I don't want to go first. Oh, actually, it says the blue player goes first. So. Yes. All right. You said that at the beginning. Summon rune stones on any number of spaces adjacent to your nomadic Vikings. All right. All right, here we go. Uh, so what? Wait, what? I can summon them next to my nomadic Viking that is a Viking that is not in a settled region. So at the end of my turn, I can summon rune stones in any number of spaces adjacent to your nomadic Vikings. So... At the end of my turn, I could essentially put out a boatload so, of Junes. About, anywhere all the way around you, right? All of them. Any. Uh, adjacent to your nomadic Vikings. Uh, adjacent. Next to. Yes, but any. I could I could do all these ones right here. I could lock up two points if I really wanted to. End this game early. That's not how it works, but I could. Uh, it's I a mean, weird. you could lock up three whole points and I'll take everything else. See, so that's what I'm talking. You know what? I'm actually, you know what? I'm going to try and lean into my special ability. I'm going to reverse reverse that. I'm just going to, uh, let's try and break it. I'm going to try and break it, see what happens. I'm going to go right there. And then I'm going to go right here. And then no, I'm going to. adjacent. Yes. I'm not adjacent. Oh, that's your one that you're placing. Yes. I was confused. Okay. That seems. That seems. I'm getting you. I. Like, a, okay, I guess mine is kind of meanish. I didn't know. All right. That's my turn. I my... just get to push you. You have to be next to me. Okay. I can't even, like, you have to be literally next to me. It's your turn, dear. Well, I'm sure they're probably pretty. I don't pretty... have. I better move this one before he gets really stuck. That one might already be gone. We'll see. Mm -hmm. All right. So this game is just as mean as uh. That's that's probably why I don't. Okay. And I'm yeah. not gonna put any. I'm not gonna use my special ability. Are you sure? Yes. I don't see how it really helped me right now. Not in this instance. When you first did it, yeah. I think that's helpful. I mean, I don't see how it could hurt. I mean, you're you're. Practically making it so that that guy can't move. That's the goal. <laughs> I, mean, so. I just wanted to see if that's what it would do. What am I doing here? I don't even know. Alright, so we're going to go here. Yeah. And then we're going to go um, there, and then we're going to summon these. Uh-huh. Hey, I just gave you three Wait, points. I've got, yeah, see, uh, more points than I got last time. <laughs> see? Look at that! But now I'm down a person. Always look at the bright side of your life. I didn't sing You're it. You're not Monty Python. I didn't sing it because I don't want to get a counter, counter strike. That's not the right word. I do love counter strike. It's your turn. <laughs> See, now I sang those lyrics in my head. Um. Hmm. This is so interesting. Mm -hmm. right, I like this game. Um, go here, and then we're gonna go here, and then we're gonna go here, and there with my special ability. So yours is way more helpful than mine. No, well, maybe. In this instance, yeah, looks like it. Mine's not very helpful. 
Like I have to be next to you and then take your spot. Which would be helpful if I could, you know, needed to push you into something. Hmm. Man, I don't even, I feel like I gotta get this guy out of here. Or maybe I don't. Maybe I don't get him out of there. Maybe I... I love how it kind of just builds like its own little pass. I think that looks really cool on the table. Hmm. And I'm not going to use my special ability. Mm-hmm. Hmm. See, the problem with this for me, with your special ability, I only got to put down one at a time. Yep. So I am subject to whatever it is that you are doing. Well, in all fairness, you are supposed to actually, one person selects two cards, and then the other person gets to decide which one of the two cards they want, and then the other person gets the second card. I figured you would not want to go through all the text on these cards, though. Would you? Uh, no. So I just randomly chose two. These are the two that I randomly chose because they seemed, well, I like this one because his name is the Sexless Frost Giant. Yeah, it's Ymir, the sexless frost giant. He's I'm, pretty jacked, too. I don't know Freya's, why he can't get any. I'm Freya's battle swine. Not interested. Did you just move me? Yes. Oh, you shoved me. I shoved you. I used my ability. Oh. I moved you back. Okay. Hmm. I'm trying to think differently not easy for me. I go there. And then I'm gonna go I don't know where to go. We'll go there, I guess. And then I'm going to do this and this and hey, what's up, Brad? I love you. We're we're in here together. My turn? It is. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no! What did I do? Oh, this is bad. This is real bad. Um, I'm going to go ahead and, and do that, I guess. I don't know. I'm so scared and alone. So can I move you here? Space. No, there's a room with a block in the way. Because it's blocking the way. Yeah. Okay. Dang. I don't think there's any other way for me to get to that space right now. I don't even think I can get to Get out! Get out of here! <laughs> no. I saw it. I just had to figure out how to get to it. No, I don't think there's anything I can do. Wait, it's my turn. It's I my know, turn. I'm looking at the board. Look at the board on your turn. Yeah, this is over. This is over. All right. My problem is that one right there. I'm gonna take. I'm gonna take this one point one from you. Then I'm gonna lock it. I'm gonna do this. No, I'm not. I'm done.
Oh, wait, what? Oh, I'm not blocked out. No, because I can't. Oh, that's so weird. <gasps> oh, wait, no, I could. I messed up. I needed to go here. Wait, where was I? I was here. Uh, I don't remember. Sounds right. Either way. I was here. I couldn't get to where I needed to go. Never mind. I think it's I a did solid not mess play. up. I couldn't get to where I needed to go. Uh, huh. What do I do? What do I do? I think our only chance is to do this. Go right here. No, don't go there. Don't go there. I was right here. Uh, I'm going to go here. That's where you just said not to go. Oh, yeah. Well, <laughs> Change not mind. good at games, dear. Not good at games. <laughs> yeah, okay. All right, here's, here's, okay, here's the play. Here's the play. I'm gonna go back to where I was. Not sure what I'm doing. Clearly. Shoo, shoo. Shush it. Go here. Then I'm going to do this. Is my one minute place. And then I'm also, since he's not trapped, I'm going to do this. This. As part of my end of your turn action. I don't think I got enough points still. But I'm trying. Yeah. Oh, no! You should just put it right there. Just put it right in there. Oh, all right. So I go one. Lock you in. And that is game. end game. And I think, yep. So I think I won this time. You did that. Just because of this. Yep. So you got one, four, five, six, nine, thirteen, uh, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two. 25, 27, 29, 31, 32. Yeah, I think you crushed me. Then we can, yeah, so 2, 5, 8, 10, 12, 15, 18, 19. There you go, all that gloom and doom talk. And I. I'm a quick study. Well, I also uh, probably just put out too many rocks. <laughs> I mean, that's a possibility. But I feel like my character was more fun. Yours was. I'm, I'm probably just not using mine right. Well, I, don't I also... have that mind frame. Either way. Either way, you can check out a whole bunch of these different cool cards if you're more interested in Ragnarok from Grey Fox Games, which come to a Kickstarter near you very, very soon. If you end up checking it out, be sure to check out the Kickstarter link down below and tell them Bowers Game Corner sent you. If you enjoy what I'm doing, please be sure to click on that subscribe button down below.